What? Wait, wait, what? We're getting out. Have I actually beaten the game? Is it over? My sweet baby boy Kaito is not feeling himself and I'm really worried about him. After my best boy and ultimate gentleman Gonto went bye-bye, Kaito has filled that void in my heart. A paparazzi should never get attached. I know, damn it, I know, but my heart is just so damn big and bulging. And I need to let people in. This episode, something bad is happening. I can feel it in my bones. It's depression time. Hey, 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 everyone, Razbeski here. I'm welcome back to Danganronpa V3 and oh, baby. Kaito has got some sort of plan to get us out of here, but it's it gonna cost him his life? I can't take it. I just can't take it. All the base people are going bye-bye. He's not even been to space yet. Guys, if you're hyped for this video, then please hit that like button. It really, really is appreciated. Let's you for 2,000 beautiful likes. And you already know the deal, ladies and gentlemen. 2,000 beautiful likes on this video, and we'll have another one in a couple of days' time. And by then, somebody's probably going bye-bye, so we're gonna need that investigation time. And if you're feeling extra special spicy hype for today's video, then in the comment section below, type hashtag hope. And we'll dive straight in, baby. Woo! Yeah, money, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen and robots? That's robophobic. You're right, I probably shouldn't have singled you out like that, Kibo. Kikichi's not here. Well, if he was, it'd be complete chaos. Uh, yes, exactly, it would be complete chaos. What are you thinking of? Uh oh. Uh -uh. well. You're worried about Kikichi, right? We're all worried too. Yes. I searched everywhere for him, but I couldn't find him at all. <laughs> Sure enough, he's a master of hide and seek. <laughs> he couldn't have escaped by himself, right? Wow. No, as long as Monokuma's here, I do not think that is possible. Jeez. Like I said, just forget about him. Anyway, uh, listen up. Listen up, everyone. I gotta tell you guys something. Kaito has an idea? It's a little awkward with Kaito right now, but I, I should listen. Yes, use your ears. Okay, do we literally have to select him? I have to go up to Kaito and say, look, buddy, tell us your plan. Come on. What? What's your idea, Kaito? So... Uh, oh, yeah. Um, uh, lacking subtlety, Kaito averted his eyes from me and looked around. No. <laughs> Looks like Monokuma isn't here. Well, I wouldn't care even if he was. <sighs> Got to turn to his expression suddenly serious. Didn't I tell you guys yesterday? I'm gonna get you guys out of here. But to do that, uh, I need your guys' help. Please. Uh, so please help me out of here. Huh? What? I mean, in order to help you guys, I need you all to work with me. Wait. Oh, hold on. What are you talking about? Um, work with you? What do you mean? Fight Monokuma with me. Huh? huh? Fight Monokuma. Listen up. Now's our best chance. Since the monocubs are gone, the exosiles that were protecting him can't move. Now's our chance to get together and kick Monokuma's ass. Fight Monokuma? I see. That must be why Kaito was looking for weapons. But, but Monokuma's probably got more spares. Won't it be pointless no matter how many we beat? <laughs> then all we need to do is destroy them one by one till there aren't any left. <laughs> but we don't know what Monokuma's got up his sleeve. Even without the exosiles, this academy is still under his control. Then you're fine with the way things are now? You guys really want to continue this killing game? Are you okay with that? Listen up. The only way to change things now is to fight. If you want to put an end to this killing game, then we gotta fight. Hey if we don't stand up now, then when? <laughs> But we don't have anyone who can fight like Gonta or Tenko. Then, then I'll just have to fight on their behalf. Huh? What? Well, I know an assassin wouldn't say this, but I'm sick of all this killing. Maki! Uh oh, Everyone. uh oh. Let's do huh? it! Huh? Kibo, you do? My inner voice that guides me when I feel lost spoke to me again. It said, now is the time to stand and fight. It may be a dangerous course of action, but it will prevent future victims. I... Then I've decided that I will fight Monokuma. Uh-oh. I've been waiting for those words. Very well. I will lend you my power. <laughs> Were you really waiting for that? I don't want to lose any more friends. It's even more painful than losing yourself. That's why I'll fight. I'm not afraid of Monokuma. Yeah. I'm okay then. Me too. We can't let the killing game go on like this. You're going to join us as well, right, Shuichi? Okay. Ye yeah, right. All right. So we all agree. That is decided. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're going to beat Monokuma to a pulp. Yeah. Yes, let's show him what we're made of. Mm. I won't even need to use my magic. No. 
No, I think that if you use magic, now's the time for it. Wow. And when did you guys want to start? I'm fine with starting right away. Yeah. Well, don't get ahead of yourself because this will be the final battle. We should make sure we're prepared. Right. Prepared for what? I'm prepared for battle, of course. Well, I'll take care of that for you guys. <laughs> So you can make preparations, but you don't clean up after yourself? Well, since I was the one who brought this up, I gotta get things prepared at least. Uh, so you guys just gotta prepare yourselves mentally. Right. The battle's gonna be tonight. Once it's night time, let's meet up at the gym. Oh, Jiminy Christmas, you kidding me? We're actually gonna battle Monokuma. We're actually gonna rumble. After we ate our breakfast and prepare for our final battle, we separated for now and return to our rooms. For an idle bit of free time in which we're going to spend with Maggie, right? Most likely, gee, many Christmas, we're actually going to take on Monokuma. I've not collected all his little beasts. A fight with Monokuma, it's true that this is our chance, but what is this sense of unease? It's because Monokuma is probably two steps ahead of us, and Kikichi too. I can't imagine he'd ignore this. He must be planning something. We have to be cautious. We have to be cautious, so we're just gonna spend our time doing absolutely nothing. Actually, not nothing. Getting to know Mackie a little better. Making my boy Kaido jealous. Kaido's been going back and forth between the gym and the school building for a while now. I think he wants to prepare for tonight, but when I offered to help, he turned me down. I told him not to overdo it, but he won't listen to me at all. What should I do? Mackie looks like she's in a bad mood. Uh, yes? Hang out? Is that That's what that true. means? Yeah, he'll make us clean his mess like he always does. Let's leave the preparations to him then. That's true. Let's go and hang out for a little bit. Me and you'll get to know uh, uh, each other a little better. I spend some time with Mackie. Since you're feeling a little bit hot-headed, Mackie, how about some boba tea? <laughs> There's some tropical balls inside if you catch my drift. <laughs> I didn't know that assassins were scouted. It's better if you didn't know. Also, there's no need for you to know. Right. Gathering children from orphanages. I couldn't believe it. Mm. Do you want me to surprise you even more then? Huh? Well... The orphanage I was raised at was run for that reason. Uh, um, what do you mean? <laughs> to raise potential candidates as assassins. What? You don't know? The cult donates to the orphanage as charity. That's believable, right? The amount of work I put in is the amount of charity given. That's how the exchange goes. Mm. I see. So that makes sense. That makes sense at all. Obviously, if Mackie then decides to not do her job, then they're like, well, we're pulling the funding from the place because, uh, well, you're not producing the clients that we need or the assassins that we need or the workers that we need. Makes sense. It's good. How much is Mackie carrying on her shoulders? A hell of a lot. Such small shoulders. Stop buying up her shoulders, buddy. Look at her face. Not her shoulders. She's a nasty detective. You said you were taken in by a man. Did he raise you? Are you asking if he raised me as an assassin? No. No, 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 that's not what I meant. Uh, you don't need to be so serious. That man scouted me and put me in a training facility. That's... I remember you saying that training was quite harsh. No matter how talented you are, a child is still a child. The basic training forces your body to go beyond its human limitations. They physically beat us to help us withstand torture and taught us how to die when needed. Uh, how, how, how to die? Yes. The only option left when you fail a mission is to die, right? It's dying sooner is the nicer way out. It's much better than being tortured alive. Yes. So you were trained to withstand torture. Ready? Would you like to hear what kind of training we endured? No. no, thank you. I think I'll pass on that one. I can't bear to think of what Mackie had to go through. Oh. After they tortured us, all I could do after was just stare at the room ceiling. They tried to break me during training, but I was still there. They tried to drag my dignity and tear it to make me feel empty. But even then, I found myself, and then they would do it all over again. It wouldn't have been strange if I broke during the torture, but even so, I tried my best. I wouldn't have accepted the job in the first place if I knew I couldn't do it. But most importantly, if I broke, then that girl would replace me. That girl? Uh-oh. Sorry. Sorry, pretend you didn't hear any of that just now. But what, 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 wait, what, what? It's fine, just pretend. Okay. All right, I understand. Okay, so she's protecting somebody. I don't think it's a sort of that girl is in a, a nasty rivalry. She, it sounds like she's protecting somebody that's maybe younger than her that would have been next in line if Mackie either fails her objectives or rips or something like that. So she wants to stay alive to do her job properly so she protects that girl. That's what I think is alluding to there, which is, oh, it's just so horrible. Mackie, what have you had to go through? Reeling from Mackie's incredible story, I returned to my room. 
room and just twiddled my balls. <gasps> I didn't do that. I did serious detective work. I don't know what'll happen, but I'll do what I can. Should I hang out with Mackie for a while? Uh, you betcha bum. Then let's do some stretches. You'll need it. What, stretches? Why, why am I having to do stretches? Oh, Mackie roll. With Mackie leading the way, we spent some time training. I don't want to train. I like not having stretches. Make me do all these stretches. I can stretch for days. Stretch for weeks. Stretch for years. <laughs> what the hell is that? You look like you want to ask something. Huh? I, I, I do? Well, whatever. I told you to pretend like you didn't hear anything, but I can't take back what I said. Hey. You're wondering who that girl is, right? She was a close friend from the orphanage. A, a close friend? Why is she smiling like that? He's like, <laughs> uh, a close friend, you see, Maggie. Why do you look so relieved? Hmm. Ah, uh, I, I do. Weirdo. Yeah, you do. It's gross. Gr gross? See, he was thinking dirty uh, thoughts, obviously. Um, I'm just glad that you have a friend like that in your life. Mm. Hmm, I see. That's why you're making a gross face. Uh, back at the orphanage, I was a normal kid. Is she angry about something? Sorry. I'm sorry. So what? It's fine. Um, then what did you mean when she said she would take your place? Please. The scouts had their eyes on her first, not me. Uh, what? Because I had enough talent, but she had even more talent. Uh, she was very kind, a crybaby who easily got lonely, but she tried to be strong. If she had been taken to such a place, then she would have lived her life crying forever. That's why I volunteered to go. At the time, I had no idea what was in store for me as an assassin, but I endured the training. If she had gone through this, she would have died. That's why I was so desperate to do my best. Oh, Mackie, you beautiful son of a gun. So she wasn't just doing it for the orphanage, she was doing it for a friend as well. Being with her was really fun. We would wear matching outfits, bake sweets, and exchange them. We would get in trouble with our teacher because we would talk late into the night. We played house often with the other kids at the orphanage. She would play as the mom, and I would play as the dad. Well, neither of us knew our parents, so the only thing we could do was imagine it. Mackie, that's surprisingly cute. I can't even imagine. So it was fun, huh? That's surprisingly cute. <laughs> surprisingly cute. What, is it? what are you saying? Don't say things are cute. That kind of thing doesn't exist in my heart. No, no I really think so. I am sure you would have made a good dad. Shut up. Shut up. Stop imagining whatever you're thinking. He's, he's, he's trying to imagine you as his daddy. Daddy Mackie. Look at that. Look at our friendship building up. We've got one more fragment to gain, baby, but we got an ultimate fight. An ultimate showdown with Monokuma to be going ahead with and doing first. Mackie shared more stories about the orphanage with me. Deep down, Mackie is just like any of us. Of course, she's still a human. She's not like that key boy. Jeez. You would have got crushed under that hydraulic press. Anyway, the music is cut out, so we got some dire situations to be getting on with. Okay, probably just a nighttime announcement. I'm kind of worried that he's already busted us because he is about. Oh dear! He's busted us. He's rumbled us. He knows our plan. That's not good. 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 M Monokuma isn't here. But what was that? No. Is the plan compromised? I should get to the gym. I'm sure everybody's gathered there. Okay, we should go. We've been chatting with Mackie. We've been flirting with, with Daddy Mackie for far too long. I've forsaken my friends. Please say everyone's all right. Please say everyone's all right. Please say everyone's all right. Okay, so we got a bunch of weapons here. Everybody seems to be here, right? Except, all obviously, right. uh, our, 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 our boy, uh, Oma. He's up to no good, probably. All right, everyone's here. I hope you're all ready. <sighs> Oh, this, uh, is there a chainsaw there? Oh, no, I thought it was a chainsaw there, but there's a bunch of nice-looking weapons over there. Are those weapons? Oh, yeah. So you went to my lab yesterday to find weapons to use against Monokuma. Yeah, yeah that's right. Hey, guys. Anyway, let's get started. You guys better be ready. Oh, you don't mean ready to die, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, no, oh, I mean ready to fight and win, obviously. Ready to fight? And when? Yeah. yeah, we challenged him a bunch of times, but it never worked out, right? Uh, that's because we gave up. Listen. But this time we can't give up, because this is our final chance. We're going to beat up Monokuma and end this ridiculous killing game. <laughs> what a coinky thing. I was planning on ending this killing game too. Upon hearing that voice, we all spun on a dime and saw him standing before us. Obviously, he's going to come and crash the party. Obviously, he's coming to crash the party. What has he got? What the hell has he got there? Why has he got a... Oh, dear. I don't like the face on that thing. You know, I was also thinking about how to end this killing game as soon as possible. Oh, dear. You little... What are you? I wouldn't move if I were you. 
At least if you don't want to become this little guy's prey. Don't you dare threaten my boy! Red? Is that a bomb? Uh, the bomb? Yep, it's exactly that. Which means, if you don't want to be blown to pieces, then you need to listen to what I'm about to tell you. Okay, uh, story time with Papa Oma. Okay, I'm all ears, you son of a gun! <laughs> tell me a story. Oh dear, what's going on? So? Wait, what was I going to tell you? Yeah, You're the one who said it. You little... What, what are you going to do with that bomb? Oh, oh yeah. I was going to tell you my purpose. Uh, you know how it says in the rules that the killing game will continue until there are only two left. But it never mentioned anything about how many you can kill, right? Once. So here's a question for everyone. <laughs> Who wants to survive with me? Just the two of us. It can't, can't be you. Are you planning to kill us all with that bomb? Are you serious? Then the way you were gonna end this killing game is He's gonna rip us all. He's gonna rip all but one. I thought maybe I should kill everyone. Except for me and like one other person. I volunteer a tribute! Kill everyone! If I did that, I'd be able to end the killing game and still abide by school rules, right? Well then, who wants to live? It's first come, first serve. On the count of three, first one to raise their hand wins. I'm raising the roof for you, Oma. I'm raising that roof. Don't screw around. Quit screwing around. Who'd ever agree to that plan? Even if you threaten to destroy me, I have no intention of being manipulated by you. I, I, I'm scared of dying, but nothing good will come from surviving with you. I, I also don't want to survive with someone who, who does such a thing to Gonta. Oh, Samugi, you're in my heart. I'd rather kill you. Is that all right? Kikichi, you just don't get it. We're not going to do what you want. Oh. oh, what a surprise. I didn't think this would go exactly as I predicted. Huh? What? <laughs> <laughs> I lied about killing everyone. I just wanted to test your determination. Huh? The determination. Oh, he makes me so mad. He makes me dance and sing with madness and rage. I wanted to see if you guys were determined enough to end this killing game. So let's work together. We can use the ultimate anti-monokuma weapons. Ultimate anti-monokuma weapons? What is he talking about? Are these hammers? Is that what you're talking about? Hammer on dolly? I guess that's what you're, the ultimate anti-monokuma weapons. Are you talking about the hammers? Cut it, Cut it out. There's no reason to listen to him, guys. Come on, at least hear me out. This is also Muse Memento. I thought they looked strangely Mew-like. Muse Memento? Yeah. yeah, they're called Electro Hammers, and they're something I asked Miu to invent. How exciting. They're a pretty incredible invention that disables any electronic machine on contact. Huh? Disables electronic machines? <laughs> <laughs> I bet that includes Kivo, too. They should be helpful against Monokuma, right? <laughs> Uh, helpful against Monokuma? Hey, how did you know we were gonna fight Mono- Ah, uh, well, I just happened to be hiding in the dining hall when I heard you discussing it. The fact that you were hiding there means it wasn't a coincidence. But I was just so elated when I heard you guys wanted to fight Monokuma, because that was my plan all along. That's how I want to end this killing game. And that's why I asked Miyu to make this, to defeat Monokuma and the Monokubs. Don't lie, you've been fixated on this killing game the whole time. Is that really something me you made? Aren't you lying about that too? Oh, you're gonna doubt that too. Of course. Have you forgotten everything you've done to us up until now? Yeah. Yep, I forgot. Yeah, how do you expect us to believe that? This doesn't make sense. If me you made that weapon, why didn't she... Why didn't she use that instead of murdering someone? Yeah, if there were weapons to fight against Monokuma, we should have all fought together. This is all your fault. Huh? Our fault? Oh, man. I told me you too, you know, around the time I asked her to invent this. I told her that we should fight against Monokuma, but she... What did she do? Hold on a second, what? What a pain in my ass. Why do I gotta make this again? Well, you know. Quit complaining. This is all an un ugly use good for it anyway. Oh my god, you're a savage son of a gun. He is savage. Have some respect for the rusting in peace. 
Okay, okay. No, but this is so exciting. When this is done, we can probably defeat Monokuma, right? Especially when we all join forces. Don't be stupid. If you're going to do it, do it yourself. It doesn't matter if we promise to work together. Someone will still betray us. Betray us and kill one of us. Besides, this weapon won't make a difference. We'll be killed by an exocile before we can use it. I just invented it because I was asked to. I have no intention of defying Monokuma. There's no way we can beat him, and I cannot afford to die here anyway. Listen up! No, when I still need to invent something that's going to change this world. So, if you want to defend Monokuma, do it yourself. Come with me! But if it does work out, come help me, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll do anything, anything to thank you. Oh dear, that was, that's filthy. Someone will still betray us. That's what she said. Well, the exocells were still moving at the time, so I don't blame her, but she was afraid to trust you guys. The fear of betrayal overcame her. That's why she bloodied her hands in this killing game. That idiot. But you guys are different. You guys wouldn't lose to the fear of your friends betraying you, right? You showed your determination to fight together, and you ignored my advice from earlier. No. And you would lie about killing all of us just to test a theory? Yep, that's why I wanted you guys to do your best. Oh, wow. Quit screwing around. What are you saying? You probably just lied about talking to me. You. Oh, by the way, the electro hammers weren't the only thing me you made. <laughs> she made this thing too. What? A b bomb too. <laughs> it's not exactly a bomb though, even if it's called an electro bomb. It jams electronic signals by scattering particles that interfere with electromagnetic waves. <laughs> For two hours, any and all electronic devices within 50 yards will be completely disabled. It's perfect for any secret activities too, since it doesn't leave behind any debris. Uh, this invention is extraordinary, but I only have three of them. Oh so I need to use them carefully. You guys will have to settle for the electro hammers. Please wait. Settle? We have no intention of using such suspicious looking hammers. Uh, Are you sure? You can use these electro hammers not only against Monokuma. But also to get through that underground tunnel. The underground tunnel? You can use the electro hammers to destroy the electric traps in that place. Is, 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 that, is that true? Oh, are you finally starting to believe me? But be careful. Electro hammers run out of battery pretty quickly. So if you use it against an exocile, it'll run out of juice with just one shot. Got it? Once the battery depletes, it takes 24 hours to fully charge, so watch out for that. Anyway, I'm done explaining, so I'll hand the electro hammers over. I'll let you guys talk it over. I won't interfere anymore either. Huh? Won't interfere? Yeah, we looking over from a distance or something like that. You don't want me around anyway. No. Wait, before you run off again, there's something I need to ask you. What was the writing in the courtyard? Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do need to discover this. That message that Gonta found, th th this world is mine, I, I believe it said. Did you write that? And if you did, why? Yeah, why did you do it? Spit it out, snake boy. Mm -hmm. Hmm, what's that? I have no idea. Don't lie. Don't play dumb. Your name is on it. You gotta be the one who did it. Right. But I wouldn't gain anything from writing a message like that, would I? That would just make you guys suspect that I'm the mastermind. The mastermind? Because. Yeah, this world is mine, Kikichi Oma. That would make me seem like the mastermind. Oh, oh I know. This is all Monokuma's doing. He's trying to get us to suspect each other. But don't worry. I truly want to end this killing. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Suddenly, a dark shadow slid between us and quick as a flash. Wait, whoa, what, what happened? Oh! Whoa, 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 Matthew, you need to chill out, girl, because he might have actually been telling the truth this time. It's hard to tell. He's such a snake. Tell us the truth. What are you scheming? She is on fire right now. She is raging. Like I said, we just want to end this killing game. That's all. If you don't tell us the truth, then I'll break you. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, you can hear his neck go in. Rocky Roll, cut it out. You'll get killed if you don't. I told you, we can't play this killing game. That's just what Monokuma wants. Come on, Mackie Roll, you gotta put him down. You gotta put him down, Mackie Roll, please. Please. Thank you, girl. Thank you. Just put it. It's not worth it. Maki let go and Kikiji's body fell in a heap on the floor. Come on, we gotta chill here. We gotta chill. Jeez, you're so.
such a meanie. How do you do something like this to a friend? Friend as if. You guys may not think that way, but I see you all of you as my friends. That's why I'll be back. I won't interfere anymore, so please continue to walk the path you believe in. Oh, I can't tell what he's up to. He's made it very, very difficult for me to believe in him. And I know people trust him in the comment section below because you've probably seen ahead. But he still just, he teased me off. He really just rustles my jimmies. Kokichi picked himself up and staggered to the exit. Jiminy Christmas, he left behind the electro hammers. <laughs> what should we do? You mean about the hammers? They've got to be a booby trapped somehow. But looking at it, it definitely seems like something Mew made. Either way, I refuse to believe anything he says. But, you know, if it's not a lie, then this isn't our one chance to escape. Huh? What? Listen up. If we use these electro hammers, maybe we can get through the underground passage. So, why don't we try it? What is it? You mean, actually do what Kikichi is suggesting? No ma matter what we do, it it'll be dangerous. But are you really going to believe Kikichi? Our goal is to escape with everyone, right? If there's a chance we can do it, then we should take it. We don't have enough time. T time? Uh, okay. Yeah, with Monokuma. L like he's going to get in our way soon. Mm. True. This is our best chance. Now he's not making any obvious movements. So let's try the underground passage with these hammers. We'll get to the outside world. You're right. You're right. If we can escape, we'll find ourselves the secret of the outside world ourselves. We don't know if that's a lie or the truth, though. The secret of the outside world that Despair Gunter mentioned. Was that a lie? Is it the truth? We have to get out. You're right. You're right. We have to try. Right. Yeah, that's all we got. Well, the secret of the outside world might just be a lie anyway. Either way, we should at least try so we don't have any regrets. What should we do, what should we do Mackie? That punk. If the hammer is a trap, then I'll really kill that ass. On, you can't baby. kill him, just punch him! Okay, okay. I, I know, I'm just gonna beat him to a bloody pulp. I see. I see, if everyone else is gonna do it, I understand. Yeah. Then I'll prepare myself for the underground passage again. Got it. That sounded like a euphemism. Yeah, right on! Oh, you're too excited about that euphemism there. However, I'm still concerned that Monokuma has been so quiet. He hasn't shown himself at all since the morning announcement. Where is he? I suppose there's no point worrying about it, not if I want to focus on moving forward. It's the only thing I can do. Keep moving forward. Let's keep moving forward, baby. Alright, all right, let's get going. We're going to escape from the underground passage for sure this time. Kaido gave a triumphant shout and we all grabbed our electro hammers. Yes, let's go. I'll be cheering for you. He, he, Miko, you need to come too. Uh, why is Himiko just decided to hold back? We left the gym in high spirits. Oh, I need to go too. I should head to the underground passage. Can you not just take me there? I took the final electro hammer and left the gym. Let's go then, baby. Time for destiny. Time for freedom. Time for the truth. It's not going to work out well, is it? Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, diving deep down into the bowels of the school, into hell itself. Where is it? It's over here, is it? Not manhole. Let's go. Let's go. I, I, sorry, Keyboy. I don't have time to be talking to you. I'm sure you're going to say something very insightful, and I'm sure it was fantastic, but I'm going to go to the exit. Thank you very much. Let's do it. Poison. Jiminy Christmas. Let's not leave All those right. barrels lying around. All right. Let's get started. We Are we really going to be okay? <laughs> what are you afraid of? Of course, it's gonna be okay. Right? Uh, you seem anxious too, Himiko. Uh, there's no need to worry. Of course, it's gonna be a little dangerous, but uh, we got all these ultimates here. If we all work together, everything will be all right. Those words. Yeah. yeah. We can finally fulfill Kaede's wish. Oh. It's gonna make me sad. So let's all work hard to escape this place together. And once we're out of here and make it to the outside world, why don't we all stay friends? Oh, feels. That's right. Yes, we made a promise together. That's right. Our promise to work together to get out of here and become friends. I see. Now is the time to fulfill that promise. Hmm. I'll cheer for you guys. You. you need to do it too. Gee, <laughs> Mako, you coward. This isn't the time to puss out now. That's right. That's exactly right. To keep the promise I made to Kaede, I will never give up. I, I, I can't give up. I will never let them go. Let's go. 
To the exit! To the passage entrance, baby! I've come this far, I have no choice but to believe. With a hammer that Miu invented, I know we can do it. I have to believe that. I kept repeating that to myself as I stepped into the tunnel. I have to believe that, I have to believe that. We can do this, we can do this! Star escape! Oh, we got the hammer now! Oh, please tell me I can do this! Please tell me I can actually escape! I need to get out of here, okay. Oh, so I just broke it! Oh, no! Uh, how do I jump? I, I I lost my main man. I can't do this. We'll just forget that last turn happened. Is this it? I'm actually out. I'm free. I'm free. Clear. Let me out, baby. Let me out. I've got everybody out as well. All six of us survived. All six of us are out. Let me 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 out. Finally, we made our way out of the tunnel. It was so long. We thought there was no end, but there was an end indeed. And in the end, there was freedom. Please tell me it's freedom. Oh, we're here. We're here! The end! Huh? Is this the exit? Right. It seems like it. Look there! Oh, the exit is there, oh baby. My. Oh, it's a door on the other side of that door. Yeah. Yes, yeah, probably the outside world. We're here. We're finally here. Let's get out. Yeah. We did it. We can finally escape. Yeah. Don't get your hopes up. We need to know if this is actually the outside world. Right. Yeah, right. We don't know what the outside world looks like now. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Monica Barbara was probably just lying to us. The skies over this academy are normal, so the meteorites are probably gone. Everything's fine out oh. there. Anyway, let's open that door. We, we have plenty of time to talk afterward. Mm -hmm. Yes, let's get out of here. That looks similar to the electric barrier in the front of the exosal hangar. Unless we disable that, we won't be able to open that door. Right. Let's look around. Yes, let's look around. Let's look around real quick. Oh, yes! It's almost time to get out of here. Operation panel! Let's do it! Could it be? This is the operation panel for the barrier. If this like the one in the exosal hangar, I should be able to disable the barrier with the passcode. <gasps> A password? Does anyone know it? It's, it's 59 digits long. Uh, we don't need that. Oh, yeah. If it's electronic, we just gotta destroy it with these hammers. It seems this lock is controlled electronically, so we can use the electro hammer to open it. Right. Let's destroy the control panel with the hammers and open this big dumb gate. Then everything will be over. We can say goodbye to this academy and this killing game. That's true. Finally, this death game is going to end. Yeah. Yes, at least we can return to our normal lives. Normal lives. Beyond this door is our normal, peaceful, boring lives. We'll all be able to go home to those normal lives. The secret of the outside world couldn't be that awful, right? Let's go! Let's go! It's finally time to graduate from this academy of lies! With that, Kaito swung the electro hammer and... <gasps> Smash it down onto the control panel! What's, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Are we actually gonna get out? Wait, 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 what? Okay. It's opening. It's opening! We can get out! We can actually get out! Let's go! Lock disabled. Ah. Yay! The door's unlocked! Right. Now we just gotta open this gate! Let, let, let's all work together! Yeah. Yes, we can do it. Hey, finally, finally we can get out. Let's do it. Let's do it then. Let's go. And we all ran at the door. And with our own hands, with our own strength. We opened it. We got to open it. We got to open it right. We opened that door. Our door to the future. A door of hope and despair. What? Wait, wait, what? We're getting out. Have I actually beaten the game? Is it over? Because I completed that 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 level? Oma's not here. Oh, where's Kokichi? Oh, dear! What the hell? It's like some kind of toxic wasteland. What the hell is going on? He, was, he wasn't lying. The world is gone. What the hell is going on? Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Is this... What was what's, what's, what's going on? What is this? Oh, I, 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 I I can't breathe. Ah! Shut the door! Shut the door! I I I I I, 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 I can't breathe. Are we all knocked out? What? What was going on? What? The door is now locked. What? Barely conscious. We heard a sound in our heads. How, how's the door locked? What? What are you doing? What? What happened? <laughs> I hate you. 
I hate you with every fiber of my being. Why? Why have you done this? What have you done? Congrats, you finished the killing game. Kikichi, are you okay? Get it together. It wouldn't be funny if you died here, you know. Your lives are pretty precious to humanity. What, what, what? Humanity? <laughs> well then, the fun starts now! It's finally time to reveal everything! I shook my head dizzy. The ground spun underneath me, but I managed to get to my feet. At the same time... What the hell is going on? What has he done? <laughs> what was that just now? <laughs> What's going on? On the other side of that door was... Where even are we? What in the world is going on? Good morning, everyone! How are you guys feeling? Terrible. <laughs> of course you guys are, because you now know the truth of the outside world. <laughs> the truth... Of the outside world. <laughs> you saw it, right? The outside world you guys so desperately longed for doesn't exist. What, what do you mean it doesn't exist? <laughs> do you want to know? Then I'll tell ya! But you won't be telling us today, you little snake, because I'm going to end it off on a fantastic cliffhanger there, ladies and gentlemen. I know you got to be salty. I know you got to be mad with paparazzi, but 2,000 beautiful... No, 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 i tell you what. If you make it to 3,000 likes on this video, then tomorrow... I'll bring out another video. How does that sound? 2,000 likes and it'll be over the weekend and 3,000 beautiful likes will be tomorrow. There's an incentive for you, ladies and gentlemen, because this was a nasty cliffhanger, but I've been recording for over an hour now and your boy's got a lot of work to do. Either way, guys, if you made it all the way to the end, put hashtag snake down in the comment section below and I'm going to get out of here. I've been Razbowski, you've been the beautiful Raspberries as always for watching and I love each and every single one of you. Goodbye. I hate Kikichi!